Some big news coming in. Lawyer of the man who gave Supari the biggest scoop in Kilpanun plot. The lawyer Gupta's extradition to the U.S. inevitable. This is what the lawyer of the man who gave Supari says. The lawyer says only political clout can help Gupta. Czech lawyer says Gupta is innocent. Gupta not the man the U United States is looking for. Well, this is big development considering the United States says that there is uh, an Indian plot to kill Gurpatwan Singh Pannu. Uh, this man who is known to be a Khalistani uh, extremist, he has been sending out threats. Gurpatwan Singh Pannu has been constantly threatening India on various of his social media platforms. And uh, in the latest, United States says there's been an India plot to kill Pannun. And there could be a senior official within the Indian government who could be involved. Now, the latest information coming in on this case, as India Today gets this information, a lawyer, a Czech lawyer, uh, says that Gupta's extradition to US is inevitable and that only political clout can help Gupta at this moment. Gupta is innocent. He's not the man the United States is looking for. Geeta Mohan has spoken to that lawyer. Let's have a listen. This is an India Today exclusive. Days after reports emerged of an Indian national, Nikhil Gupta, in uh, the custody of Czech Republic for charges of murder for hire, he now has a legal counsel in Prague. And I'm being joined by the lawyer himself, Petrus Lepishka. Thank you so much for joining us here on India Today, Petru. Let's begin with the case itself. Uh, how did you learn of the case? What's the details of the case that now is on and ongoing in Prague? I think uh, you have uh, lots of information about the, his case. Uh, he was uh, he was uh, in custody at the end of uh, June. Now he is in cust he is in custody uh, more than four. Uh, for five months. Uh, during uh, this period, uh, there was an interrogation uh, from the United States. Uh, it was very, very unusual because there were five American agents, American state prosecutor, and also 12 American agents were uh, connected through uh, some video device. So uh, then... Uh, after the decision of uh, municipal court, uh, <coughs> when the municipal court decided to extradite Mr. Gupta to the United States, the American share or issued a new indictment. There are more precise information about the crime. And now we, in Czech Republic, we are waiting for hearing beside court. All right. Um, how strong is Nikhil Gupta's case when it comes to this entire plea of extradition? What is the evidence that the United States has provided so far? Uh, given that when it comes to conversations with India, India is still waiting for, uh, for uh, uh, evidence with regards to the murder for hire charges against Nikhil Gupta. Only evidence what we have received is statement of one American agent. There is nothing more. In the statement, uh, or also in indictment, uh, there are mentioned uh, many evidence against Mr. Gupta, like, like video calls, audio calls, but we haven't received anything. Okay. Uh, what about the evidence of Nikhil Gupta having paid uh, an agent over there who was working as an undercover agent of the DEA? The DEA. Um, any information, evidence it's regarding evidence. the exchange of money? What I see on the picture is that there are, there, are, there are four hands and money between the hands. Nothing more. What, 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 what's the, this evidence? Mr. Gupta wasn't in the United States, so not his, uh, it's oh, not okay. uh, his hand. So you what have been shown photographic evidence? No, and it I haven't been shown. I have five... five uh, found it uh, in American indictment. Okay, and uh, and the person in question is not Nikhil Gupta. I suppose it can't be Nikhil Gupta because the picture is from United States. Nikhil Gupta, uh, last visit of 
the guilty in the United States is dated 2017.